massive work one work one yeah man so in this video i'm gonna do just a simple recipe fry fish so i'm wearing gloves because i purchased a new knife and it chooses to christen my right thumb so i put a band-aid on it and then i'm wearing gloves because it is hygienic whether on camera or off camera so in case you're wondering why i'm wearing gloves because everybody don't know so i wear gloves right yeah man so i am blending a few spices to season the fish because unlike chicken or meat fish as a neutral flavor and you know if you use too much spices to season the fish then it will mask the taste of the fish so when you're eating the fish you're tasting the spices but you're not tasting the flavor the natural flavor from the fish and of course many people do not mind that but for me personally I want to taste the fish but I want it to be well seasoned and for that reason I always strike a balance so I use a few spices and spices that are not strong in flavor so I use all-purpose black pepper and I'm using just a little bit of Laurie's seasoned salt and that's it The fish that I'm using is not my best choice in terms of the size. I like to fry fish that is a little bit bigger in size. Anyway, that's all they had at the seaside this morning. My husband went there. So I'm using pargi, called pagi in Jamaica. That is butter fish. And then parrot, pink parrot. So I'm going to season the fish with the blended spices. So I am going to use two cloves garlic and one green add pepper to season the oil. I fry the fish on low heat because when I fry it on medium low or medium heat, it tends to brown too quickly. So I am using vegetable oil to fry the fish and then I'm going to add the garlic as well as the hot pepper to season the oil and i like to remove them before frying the fish Butterfish is a bit oilish and mega, or as we say in Jamaica, maga, because as it touches the hot oil, it stretches. That simply means that it's not young and it's not fat. Nevertheless, it is okay. So my husband does not like his fish fried cripsy or that cripsy. He said that all of the substance gone out of the fish when it is cripsy. So if so, I fried 
both sides for probably I would say like five or six minutes if you like your fish extra crispy you can go like eight nine minutes I think yeah so I am putting onion on the fish he does not like his onion soaked in vinegar yeah man be a picky eater in my house trust me so he's gonna have this with bread and you better believe this there are more jamaicans in jamaica eat fish and bread than fish and festival or fish and bami trust me yeah man so that's it for this recipe simple recipe most people already knew how to do this but me just uh show you how me do it you see me yeah man thanks for watching and remember say to subscribe and one love peace and love what would until next time